As Nigerians grapple with the harsh economic climate, a growing trend of distressed sales is emerging with people selling their possessions to make ends meet. This practice is gaining momentum as the cost of living soars, leaving many people with few alternatives. Neil Samson has more. The distressed sale refers to the rushed sale of assets such as securities and property. The sales are arranged very quickly and generally at a loss to urgently cover significant debts. These FCT residents share their thoughts on the phenomenon. Food is hard. As I then, we used to buy a module of Gary, like 150 naira. But now, the last time my wife bought, 1,200. So that's the reason why, simple, the reason why we're going to distress sales. I have to feed my kids. My children, they have to go to school. You want to sell off whatever you have so that you can be able to jump out of the country. And so because of the stress I'm already going through here, I want to sell whatever I have. So because of that, I will look for anyone available around. Please, can you buy this thing? And they will tell me, so, so amount. Even if I, it's not what, if I can check the value of that thing with the market, I can tell that, okay, it's even more expensive. But because I need the money almost immediately, I will just let go of that thing just to have the money to leave the country. I think it's because of the the hardship. A whole lot of people can't even afford three square meals anymore. So the demand of selling anything to get something to put on the table is really high at the moment. It's because of the hunger now. It's just like, was it not just we, how many weeks ago we went on hunger um, protests? I, I, I was part of that protest. Despite the general notion that these assets are often disposed at a loss, once sold under the nomenclature of distress, these FCC residents, however, have different views on the issue. We take advantage of the situation. We take advantage because of the corruption that's eating into the country. It eats into every sector. So every sector is taking advantage. The, the, the child that is selling, even if it is granite and if it is a distress sales, they take advantage of it. Sometimes when you check the value of these things in the market, it's almost twice less than the amount they are selling in the market. For instance, now, somebody can say a phone of about 115,000 naira. This stress will make you sell it at 50,000 naira. That's even much less than the amount that is sold at the market. It's a choice. Like me now, if I, if I actually need something and I have no choice, definitely I will have to sell what I have in order to get the money and feed the bills at the moment. So I, I won't feel cheated because nobody is forcing me. Deji Mike, a businessman, who deals in sales of laptops, phones, and other gadgets here in Abuja, sheds more light on the distressed sale business and eats risks. As a businessman, somehow it's to our advantage because it gives us the bargaining power this time. You know, when the customer comes to buy from you, they are bargaining with you, you have to sell as low as possible. So when they come to sell to us, we bargain with them, but it also come with his risk. Now, it's not really to our advantage. I've had people saying that those of us that buy from them are cheating. Now, there are a lot of risks involved. One, we have to be sure you are the owner of this device so that we don't end up selling to someone and having issues. We have to be sure that this device is intact. Then there's also the possibility of not selling immediately. Prices rise and drop. And even if it doesn't drop, new devices are coming out. So if your device is way back, the value keeps dropping. So while buying these things, we try to make sure we maintain a kind of equilibrium that won't be cheating the customer and won't be affecting our business negatively also. With economic downturn seen as one of the major reasons for the increase in distress sales in Nigeria, Nigerians are appealing to the central government to address issues around the economy in order to ease the present economic tension. No, Samson, Trust TV News, Abuja.